what originally drew me to the idea of shooting a block party was uh, trying to expose some of the diversity of like the gentrifying 19125 we're in and kind of giving everyone a neutral platform, like a pink backdrop. Uh, I wanted it to be kind of fun and slightly sarcastic. It's kind of important to me. I like a lot of the interesting characters that are around here and they can be somewhat unapproachable and I, fi I figured it would be a good way to kind of get them on a neutral kind of light um, ground and sort of break down some of those uh, barriers that, you know, we might have up in the front and try to get people to actually show me, like, hey, you know, this is me. I get so I, it's sort of like a way for me to get to photograph some neighborhood people as well. I first got into photography um, doing small design projects. I kind of got into it like backwards than a lot of people. I got into it from the Photoshop end of it. I would uh, photograph all kinds of weird textures and rough things uh, for flyers and things like that. And then I started bringing the camera everywhere after that. So I got hooked on like just shooting everything. And uh, what kind of kept me with it was like noticing how things would change from the time that I photographed them. You know, the way things age, they get weathered, like people, you know. And that kind of what, that, that sort of sentiment kept me with it. My, my style is just a sort of like, if I'm interested in something, I just run at it as much as possible. I've, um, I've been fortunate enough to uh, have some friends and a lot of help from a lot of really nice people who uh, have taught me a lot. And uh, I guess that's sort of a lot of how I learned from other people. I'm always working on something. Uh, right now I'm doing a lot of like bands and music stuff. A lot of sort of like just street photography in the neighborhood. Nothing under like a particular moniker or name. Just kind of, uh, kind of just doing what like draws me to this. Like this, even this project wasn't like this huge planned out thing. It just kind of became after the fact. And it's sort of sometimes how I work.